I done already showed y'all. I wasn't playing around. I see all of these right here. These is all going out. Just so y'all know. So y'all ain't trippy no more. You know what I'm saying? Alright, this bad boy right here. You understand me? This is what's getting the job done. This young HP right here. You know, and the reason why I let y'all know this is so that y'all know. Y'all documents. Look at this, man. Look, look. These is all these Mac registration numbers. We got about 20 of these things, 30 or 40 of these things. The reason why is we nationalizing this empire, baby. Yeah. Look, I can't be getting too loud because my folks is going to be saying something. All right, so let me rock with y'all real quick. This is what I need y'all to do. This email right here, when y'all send all of y'all request please send it to this email when y'all send y'all request it's going to print out directly to me directly from my printer that's what i need from y'all so i just shaved so i look like a youngin my hair is crazy i've been up filling these orders for some hours these last couple days, I go to sleep, I wake up, fill the orders. Go to sleep, wake up, fill the orders. Mm. Um, but I love everybody. So now y'all finna get everything. We got the seals, we got the stamps, we got the lodeo cards, we got consultation. Let me see, we got lawsuits for child support. What else we got? Our team handles everything. Our team will completely sew you up as a Moroccan national. Let me see. Child support services. So if you use a mom or a dad dealing with child support, the central consular team is going to help you with some lawsuits to be able to get that child support up out your system or from harassing you. Study documents. Thousands of them. Tens of thousands of study documents. You will never have to buy another book in your life. All you got to do is contact me if you want a book. I love you too, Alicia Bay. And I'm about to mail you all of your documents and scan them to you. Uh, when I scan your documents to you, whatever we send into your feudal landlord, uh, it's going to be sealed and stamped. You print those out. Then I'm going to mail you your originals. I want you to put them up. We got trust perfection in here. There's trust perfection. Central consulate judge providing over your cases. Nationality. Criminal cases, traffic tickets, uh, remedy, anything you can think of. Larry, Larry Earl Jones. Listen, here's what I need y'all to do. Because this is what y'all doing when y'all help me out. This 849-OLAFS-389-OGI three eight nine O G I at hpeprint.com. Y'all sharing this up. This is where all the nationals is going to send a request to. I'm going to get the request. It's going to print out when they email it to me. And then I'm going to go to work. Bam. Fly this thing out. We nationalizing this empire, baby. We ain't got time to be messing around with nothing else. We getting down to business. We need a thousand requests a week. We don't care. If you got the fiat and you can help with the Elodio cost, thank you. If you don't, Still nationalized because we got you covered. And there's other Al Moroccans that love you enough to put some in to this government so we can do what needs to be done for everybody. Woo, come on, baby. Everybody sleep right now, so y'all know I can't be my usual self. But uh, when I get to y'all later, you know I'm going to get to you. And we're going to have some fun. Uh, one of y'all, I need y'all, if y'all at y'all computer, some of y'all at y'all phone. Can y'all please put this in this comment section? This particular here, I'm gonna help, I'm gonna hold y'all up. I need that in the comment section. I need that. Give it to everybody. Anybody that wants to nationalize, give that to everybody. And anybody who's anyone. When I get the request, my team going to put it in the mail 
and send it to you. In the meantime, as far as the 1099 OID and the, pro uh, the processes that we were speaking about last video, we'll be sending that out in a mass email as well. Woo! I'm glad y'all are alright. Every time y'all get on here and I see that y'all are alright or participating, I know that y'all are alive and breathing. If you got breath in your body, you okay. I don't care what's going on in your life. If there's breath in your body and you still got goals, you okay. Goals. G-O-A-L-S. You need goals. What are you doing today? What are you accomplishing today? Please. In which ways are we being assertive and affirmed today? All right. We need to be active and applying. How are we applying the knowledge and the information that we are receiving? Oh, Chauncey Bay, it's so good to see you. I'm just leaving this up here because everybody needs to get this down. This is the way that people are going to send me. What are you sending when you email us to this email location? You are sending the name on your birth certificate. That's called your wardship name. You're going to see that sentence in the affidavits and the writs. You're going to see classically mis uh, misclassified, previously misclassified as wardship name, and then you're going to put the name on your birth certificate. Every other place on the documents is going to be where your free national name goes. When we send it to you, it's already going to be witnessed, size, seal, stamp. You don't have to mail it back or nothing. It's already going to be done. We're going to scan a copy for Central Consulate's records. That's how you know, and you'll get the scan copy as well. You're able to access your records at any time. Oh, it's such a beautiful thing. Now we streamline. And then, uh, I don't know, I thought I put a little touch in here. I did it by accident. But on these documents, so y'all so y'all ain't crazy. In the middle of them, on each page, you got the Moabitis. Now that's the touch of the central consulate. When you get your, uh, your paperwork, the Moabitis queen balancing the scales of my yacht. And this is just a trial one. I, I was practicing so I could have these things perfect for y'all. But we're going to put her right in the middle when we emboss this. Yeah. So, y'all know I'm working on y'all behalf. I promised the Nationals that I would have all the paperwork out by today or tomorrow. Uh, can you hand me that right there? I appreciate you. We got staff in the consulate and friends and people going through stuff these right here got hundreds of these see I got so many of these these is so I could put them on all of these things now I'm gonna get the other labels the other labels is uh for y'all we get y'all labels right um I I don't really know um oh y'all need one of these gel ink stamp pad right there the red so y'all can put y'all thumbprint on any of y'all documents. Now listen, when y'all email this right here, you can email me anything. You can email me affidavits and writs so I can seal them for you and scan them back to you or send them to these belligerent occupiers. If y'all list in the email who you want me to send your writs and your affidavit to, like the feudal lord who keeps harassing you, or these belligerent policy enforcers, these bastards who change the language. They change the language to disrupt your frequency. You used to speak Latin. It sounded so beautiful. And that Latin and those frequencies and those vibrations will do something to your brain and your body making you feel good. Oh, how to counteract um, silent wars. Let me tell y'all how to counteract them. I'm leaving this email up because I need anybody who Central Consulate said they was going to get documents to. I'm mailing them out. If I forgot about y'all, I'm sorry. It took me a minute to save up for this printer and these equipment that I needed. Now that I'm up and running, whomever that I forgot about, y'all need to contact me via this email and tell me, hey, I done paid you. 
I done, I done sent you uh, some, some love notes for this, for that. Hey, I done called you. I done sent you five emails. You still ain't got back to me. Y'all got to keep up with me, please. It's so many people on the line, everywhere, on the messenger, in two or three email accounts, in my uh, regular messenger on my phone, uh, everywhere. I cannot find a place where there's not some type of request for some service or something. I don't care about that because now I'm conditioned. It's my life, loving up on the nationals, doing what I can. That's not an issue for me. I'm streamlining. I find a centralized email that I have for you in the next couple of days to where you send all your inquiries. The website's almost up as well. Um, woo! Forgive me if I sound a little choppy. It's been a rough couple of days. Um, if y'all want to test this out while y'all sitting on the phone with me, if any of y'all want to email me something right now to this email address to see if it worked. Now, yesterday somebody did and it did work. If y'all phone or y'all on the computer and y'all want to email this particular address from your phone to see if it comes out this computer while we sitting here, then we're going to see the success story. Because then I don't ever have to go check anything again. Just email me the request, I seal it, stamp it, scan it to you, mail it to your location, and this is a streamlined process now. And we good. I finally, look, I'm waiting for one of y'all to do it. Look, I'm keeping it right here until I get some popping out this printer. Y'all got to get on the line and send something out this printer. And whatever you send me, it's going to come directly to this. Ooh, y'all look so beautiful. Every last one of y'all. I be seeing y'all pictures. The pictures don't compare in real life how beautiful you are. How worth my time you are. If I didn't have y'all love and support, when y'all calling me in and rooting for me and keeping me up and going in service to the people, I don't know what I would do. So that's why I say, y'all worth y'all worth yourselves. Y'all worth loving yourselves, to be honest. Y'all worth coming together. Woo, come on now. Now, when somebody tell me that y'all send something, then I'ma look. Alicia Knox, go into your Google Drive or wherever you can on your phone and email something to this particular address. Um where am I at? Can you hand me one of those? I'm going to um, show y'all real quick. Now, Sharon spoiled y'all. She gave y'all the, uh, the pretty paper. I'm not going to give y'all the pretty paper until I make some more uh, resource for the consulate. Then I give y'all some pretty paper. Because the, <laughs> the pretty paper costs a lot of money. But... There we go. Now those already got it. Bam, bam. I'm just showing so we know what to do when you receive your documents. As verification that I, then you put your Morris appellation right there. See, this way there's no confusion. You write it with your own hand. See, we don't do that. This way you have to read it to know where you got to sign. You write it, and then you're good. Now, with the uh, judicial notice, I'm going to show y'all something because folks, is, uh, they're going to have a problem with this judicial notice. So I have to show y'all. Is that? No, that's the, it's the name declaration that it's on. Hold on here. I got to get y'all. Uh, I want y'all to know where to sign. Oh, somebody sent something through this printer. Y'all did. Who emailed me? Who sent me an email? Whoever did. Look, Chauncey Bay, look at look at you, Chauncey Bay. <laughs> See, I love it when the nationals can think together and walk together in unison. Oh, I'm gonna tell y'all what I got. Uh, 
Somebody email me. It's lying. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Hold on a minute. I'm getting something else. Look. Uh, where's my... Um, no. -uh. I'm looking for... Um, my name declarations. Because I got to show y'all something on these name declarations when I get... When I find them. Where's my name declarations at? I got a whole stack of them. Lawful notice. Here we go. See, this is what y'all need to know. Test, test, test. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. So now y'all know. You can send me written affidavits and uh, email them to me from your phone if you need to. Okay. So everybody know. You're going to be reading this. Bang, 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 bang. Love, love. Bang, bang. Truth, truth, truth. Truth, truth, truth. And you're going to get down to this right here. Wardship name. After that wardship name, you're going to put the name that's on your certificate of live birth right there. We ain't going to mess your documents up because you're writing it with your own hand. So whatever it is that you write stands as law. Ain't nobody going to refute these truths. So on that, everywhere else on the document, Except for right here, wardship name goes your free national name. That's the only place the name on your birth certificate goes. And what you're doing when you do that is you're disconnecting, disconnecting yourself from the service corporation. You're saying to them, you're no longer surety for their corporation. Then you got your steel, seal. Then you got your consulate seal. And then you got your indignation. As a judge, any document with my signature on it and these particular emblems and insignias, what happens is the law is enforced, Article Three Court Judge. So yes, if you're a national and there are judges who have signed for you to get picked up, warrants, eviction, even you guys in the penal system that are hitting me up in Georgia, all of y'all. Y'all have to give me the name of your judge because it's going to be a Moorish American judge rescinding the judgment of a de facto judge that has no jurisdiction over you. Most of y'all are well-versed now if y'all been on my page. Ooh, King God Ra on everything nationality if y'all been on my page. We're taking cases. You don't have to see them. You don't have to go into the human trafficking venues anymore. If y'all got a case... And you let them officiate over it. You're still saying to them, you are incompetent and you don't know how to manage your own affairs. Okay. So don't let them preside over anything that has to do with your affairs at all. Woo! Come on, Yeshua. Ida Rosales. Your affidavit in your wrist is beautiful. I love seeing the work that you do. I'm finna call you up because last month we were supposed to get together. Uh, I love all of y'all very much. Thank you for sending me test emails. Now you know, when you send us an email to get nationalized, and that's the very first principle, you nationalize in order to have the bloodline that exists on the land, that are heirs to it, to enjoy the land. You decolonize the land by nationalizing. If you come together as a family, then that colonized family, they have to go somewhere or do what your family says. Because you, your family, all together are heirs to the land. Woo! Just come together and start speaking with one voice. And your little and your 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 mini communities, wherever you at, come together. We're this bloodline. We're heirs to this land. We don't want you here no more. <laughs> and they got to respect the voice of one family. That's why we deal with this consulate because it's not just you speaking. It's the entire body. Everyone. For one national, we got like five people, five to seven people that send 
the same writs and affidavits from different emails about one national situation to a judge. We will overload them. We will, we, we will put mountains of truth on them. Oh, my goodness. When we do this, I swear to you, our team be overloading the system. They get emails. Then after emails, they get telephone calls. Then after telephone calls, they get um, hard copies in the mail. If they, if if we in their general location, we show up, knock on their door. I mean, they can't sleep. I swear to you, they wish they could go to sleep. From man, look, I be vib I be vibrating so high on them. They don't know what to do with this frequency. I swear to you, I be vibrating so high. They don't know what to do. They just gotta cover their ears. Or get healed up. You know those frequencies transform you and do something to your cells. Oh, man. They better talk about it. Oh, listen. Liquid selenium. Liquid selenium and liquid magnesium. I swear, it is the miracle potion. I'm telling y'all how to combat these silent wars that's going on out here. Yes, I got the seal right there. It cost me monies. Okay? Out of my own mouth. That's the stamp. Cost the monies out of my own mouth so I could heal the nationals. Okay? I bought all this stuff, five, six hundred, seven hundred dollars worth of stuff, so that I could send the nationals everything that they need when they're calling on me. Okay? Spending my life in this. Everybody's talking all crazy to me, but they ain't sitting in the bedroom with thousands of writs and affidavits in front of them trying to help the nationals. Come on with it, baby. They ain't listening to me when I'm answering phone calls in the middle of the night with people telling me they being evicted from their home and folks showing up at my door and she know that I love her. But this is what happened to me. They was in trouble. I said that I could help. They believed me. Actually, they knew in their heart. They didn't even believe, because believe, it means illusion. And they busted a move. Oh, come on, Yeshua, uh, Italian Rosa. Get this popping now. This is the law, baby. Make sure to include 28 U.S.C., 1605 and 1607 into all your affidavits. This removes all immunity they will try to claim because you gave them proper notice and always file counterclaims. So that, count, that counterclaim, when you do that, is that that U.S.C. 28? That's the, that's the counterclaim, Yeshua? Because, yes, I'm I'm countersuiting these offenders. These um, uh, they look like um, they look like the Joker's big toe. The Joker got fungus on his big toe. That's what they face look like. I swear to you, this is what they look like when they. It's gonna happen, bro. We stand together one day at a time. Yes, King Rod. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. This is what I be doing. I'm trying to come together and unify. I done seen everything in the in the central consulate work. The people done called me that done got out. We be on the line every week. Anybody that wants the documents, Light got them free. In her group, in the group, central group, under Admiralty lawsuits. And because the obelisks say, or um, George Washington say, we are under the sea. That's why it's um, Admiralty lawsuits. Yes, you will. Is that the reason why? Whoever just sent the love gift, I heard the little ching ching. I love y'all and thank y'all very much. That's going to help me continue to get this ink and keep this Wi-Fi on so I can keep printing these documents. I literally do this all day. It prints 20 pages a minute. And when I print these 20 pages, then I put all the packs together. Uh, anything that the national needs. They need lawsuits for child support cases. We seal them up. They need uh, different writs and affidavits to save their homes or to put their uh, they homes in uh, trust, uh, their private mode of conveyance. We make their trust and we print it out immediately. Um, I'm telling y'all the truth. We ask for a load of your cost for the work that we do. Um, when we ask for it, if y'all don't have it all, we start with something. $5, $10, whatever. It doesn't matter. If y'all got some time, then give us your time. Okay, I do not care at the present moment as long as you're helping because this is what we need. Okay, I swear to you, it's not really uh, okay, it's bad economic resource. The really, the Willie Lynch letters, right? They say the moms, the matriarchs, was the economic resource. Well, people are period to them, people are chattel, their economic resource. Well, if you turn it around and you're that resource for your own bloodline and your own family 
in your own government, in your own children, in your own everything, instead of waking up every day and being that for some corporation or some man, you ain't never met the owner of the corporation. Where are they? Where is the owner of the people that you work for, of the company? Like, has he ever shook your hand or, like, feigned any interest in you whatsoever other than what you can do for the company? So you make them, like, 40 50 60 dollars an hour for the work you do and they pay you nine <laughs> i'm trying to get y'all over here in the consulate working for the federal republic government you know what i'm saying because when you're working for the oh this is the paper i'm gonna go buy this it, uh i just uh whoever just uh sent me the love gift i'm gonna use that today to go buy this type of paper and this is what i'm gonna put um the um the mac registration numbers on now, most people seen this a Lodeo title, so I'm not saying, but y'all need this for y'all house. But this type of paper, uh, that's going to be what I'm going to put on the MAC registration. So then I'm going to spoil y'all. All right? I'm going to put, what do they call? Uh, what do they call when you put uh, the, the, oh, the grommels, okay? We're going to put these grommels in there. And the grommels, uh... This is what one of my matriarchs told me. She said, when you put a grommel in there, you can't uh, mess tamper with the document. And it lawfully, lawfully, this is what they used to use, the grommels. And you put the grommels right there, and your whole document's sold up, and can't nobody tamper with it. I'm making this tamper proof, so nobody can mess with you. We're about to pretty much uh, get to our um, next wave of commissioning. And what does that look like for the nationals? If y'all have treated with me over these last few months and walk with me, I'm going to see about getting y'all commissioned for the Central uh, Consulate. I have a team of five right now. I need as many as that's willing to work in this government. Okay? Because every single day I wake up, this is the, this is the uh, commissioning right here. This is the commissioning. And back a little bit later, I read it out loud to where they commissioned me uh the great seal and the consulate and tashi bay and these people that see my heart of wanting to nationalize and bring our family together uh y'all know my telephone number okay and y'all can call me anytime day or night the nationals know that I done listen, talk to y'all on the phone, build relationships with you. I might never see y'all face to face. Woo! That's what I'm... <laughs> Look. How <laughs> you just see bumping out the... Jumping out the nowhere with it. I'm sitting here trying to have some serious heartfelt... <laughs> on my soap opera or something. And then you just bust out. <laughs> Woo! That's what I'm talking um, Even if I don't see y'all... Y'all know my spirit, that I do love y'all, and I know y'all's, because y'all wouldn't be here with me if y'all didn't love yourselves and one another. Um, make sure you email me to that email I sent at the beginning. I'll be talking to y'all soon. Nationality is the order of all days. Peace and love to you. Ooh, the Elodio title. Um, this is load of your permit and what you put on your home. You slap this on your door. And when you put this on your door and you send it to the probate court, you can put your, uh, geographical location in here or your domicile and send it to the probate court and tell them you the heirs to the land, show them the treaty of peace and friendship. You'll be sitting in your home. We also got a, a rent document from Jamal, our other consul. He done drafted up a rent document that let the people know they feudal landlords. And if they can't produce an owner, an Elodio owner, you know what's going to happen to them? You ain't got to pay no rent. So you want to send that to them? If y'all want that particular written affidavit, the only way you can enforce it is by being nationalized. If you want the, I ain't got to pay no more rent affidavit, okay? <laughs> and if the sheriff try to come see you, then send them to the consulate. 
and we'll sign the sheriff. We'll sign the judge. We'll sign the judgment and the order. We'll tell the sheriff if he step, then the United Nations will be notified. Because we got contact with them. We can talk to the United Nations and they'll send the boots on the ground. You see? It's so important that we come together. This is what nationalization is saying. It's saying we're a family. We're, we're a unified family. We love each other. And if you mess with us, we'll bust your head open. All of us will bust your one head or all of your heads if you mess with us. Because we together and unify. And we love each other so much, it hurt us to see you hurting any of our people. Oh, yeah. And even for ourselves. When we really love each other as family, we don't even let our own family member. Yeah, yeah. I swear, Well, I didn't switch them. But... Um, these ones, these papers cost more, so I only do it for specific documents. These papers cost almost a, a fourth more than the regular printing paper. So for these specific documents for your home, I just um, and, and for important things, I just change the paper up, put a little touch on it. Um, what am I thinking right now? If there's anything y'all need. At the beginning of this, uh, a load your permit document. Got your Alicia Bay. When we get off the line, uh, send me that email with everything I asked you to request. Oh, Captain L, uh, Nino Charlie, good to see you. Um, uh, when you do that, when you send me that everything you need in that request, when y'all send the email, if y'all talking about nationalization, y'all talking about, um, uh, your appellation, right? Um, the name on your birth certificate, right? After the name on your birth certificate and your appellation, your appellation first, the name on your birth certificate second, your domicile location, a telephone number so we can confirm right before we mail it off to you, everything is correct. When you send us just those four simple things. Domicile location, Morris Appalachian, name on your certificate of live birth, and somewhere where you can meet us, uh, where we can, <laughs> somewhere we can contact you to confirm. See, I'm scatterbrained because I got a lot to do, and I'm just wasting time right now. Um, I'll be back on here. Oh, in your blood, there, there's a, a, a charcoal. Okay, for your blood to remove the toxins. You take a bath in a specific charcoal. Ben, uh, oh, it's on my tip of my tongue right now. See, this is why I be sitting on here, okay, with y'all. Because I love y'all, and I know that they be trying to destroy y'all. Our bodies, our minds, and our souls, and our spirits. So I be in research on how to counteract all the things that they be doing to us so I can give it to the people when they come see me and sit at the, sit at the round table. Okay, um... They be spreading this aluminum in the air. Chemtrails, right? The aluminum in the air, it disrupt or mess up your body so you can't touch into the frequency grid of the earth and be back to your frequency, right? High frequency, vibration, cure everything. I be listening to specific hertz when I be sleep. If you take a, uh, uh, this charcoal, and be drinking it or be bathing in it. It wraps itself around the molecules, the toxins in your body, and flushes them out of your body. If you put iodine, just a little bit, tiny bit of iodine, and be drinking, and out of copper cups, be drinking the iodine, be drinking the uh, selenium, be drinking the uh, magnesium. And out of copper cups and no fluoride then what you're gonna do is counteract some of these silent wars that be going on that be messing your body up y'all know that if I sit on here long enough with y'all I'm gonna start getting excited and start showing you all type of law and doing not to be uh, void or rejected it, it, it really don't matter Tony regular paper or um, this pretty little parchment paper what you saying is what matters. The truths and the laws and you enforcing the law and the authority that's coming out of your being, 
That's what matters. We ain't never said anything but praise Jesus. That's why we ain't got nothing done. <laughs> when we went and talked to them, we didn't say what we needed them to do. Like quit abusing our kids. Quit shooting our babies down on the street. Quit putting GMOs in our food. Matter of fact, we just going to grow, grow our own food. We don't need you to do that for us, you know. We could, we could stop watching BET and Power for a minute to go uh, grow our own food and, and talk to the, um, the plants and the roots and the earth so they could grow for us, you know. <laughs> we can get off this daytime television so we can uh, get, some, get some seeds in the ground and filtrate our own water. We can do that, right? <laughs> Let me stop. <laughs> Look, y'all got to tell them what to do. It could be as simple as writing with your own hand. It don't even got to be all spectacular like this. It could be, hey, I'm by blood a descendant of so-and-so. And I just told you that. This is what you're going to do after I told you that. Because this is the law. Move around. Or uh, execute or perform this way. And you know what? They're going to look and say, oh, they're certain their authority is heirs. And then all the people's going to be like, maybe we should start listening to him. It's like, that's good. Oh, Musa, we are some. Oh, see, I couldn't even say. <laughs> I said, we bae. It's good to see you, man. I just got the Nationals ready to go with um, sending me an email to that email address. I need you to give that to everybody in all the groups. Moose, I need you to do that. Nah, it was this other one. When you do that, Moose, give that email to everybody in all the groups and tell them, I'm not keeping you in my group if you ain't a part of the family. You ain't a part of the family if you ain't nationalized. You ain't nationalizing through Central Consulate unless you have a Central Consulate registration number. In order to do that, you need to contact us so that you can continue to remain in our group. I love all of y'all. Y'all done sat and walked with us, but now I got to get off firm like that. Okay? People getting put over the knee. Here's the knee. The knee is, you got to be walking with the times, okay? We have these things to protect the nationals, where you have every single document that you need in order to sew you up to an international level. Somebody from another country could come here, and with the documents and all of the things that we got for y'all to file, and where to file them, and what to do, that person from another country, dignitary, will know who you are and how to treat you. Oh, that's a Moroccan. Oh, y'all should have seen her. She was born in Morocco. She's my personal banker, literally. I'm telling y'all the truth. I went to open a non-interest trust bearing account. This woman, name, I'm not going to tell you. She was born in Morocco. So y'all know I had to lay my jack web right. You know, for real. So now, I'm finna go straight to Morocco. Because I done laid my jack web. And I'm going to set up some treaty relations. With Al Morocco. And Morocco. <laughs> I hope y'all got that. Listen. We in Al Morocco. The empire. Northwest Africa. That Morocco. Is on some whole other. Alright. The French and them had something going on. And they messed up their children. Alright. They sold some of their children out. And in the documents. If you research. There was some of them that said. The French said. These Moors ain't going to do nothing. You could take them. They sold us, man. They gave us up. So don't be talking all to the Europeans all the time about enslaving us when we did it too. Everybody done enslaved somebody. Shoot, you could be enslaving somebody right now by the way you're treating them, by the way you're talking to them, by the way you're thinking about them, you're putting your energies on them in a specific way. You could be enslaving somebody even right now. So you better be careful on how you're treating folk. Uh -huh. Because Mama Karma don't mess around. And she will come back around. And she will get you. Stevenson, good to see you this morning. I'm glad y'all jumping on here with me. Because I'm just trying to get y'all sold up so y'all can get what y'all need. I've been giving the Nationals my word that I was going to get this work done for a few weeks now. I finally got everything I need to be able to do it right. Um, Moose, that email that I sent to you. Um... To be given to the Nationals. 
Give it to everyone. Now, my last name, people in my family, is Fowler, too. So, if you know a Benny Fowler, talking to you, James, uh, Sonetta, Williams, uh, Hobbs, um, let me think of a few other ones. <clears throat> Sander, um, Williams, any of them. We probably blood. Woo, Brian Abernathy. Uh, Okay, we could provide these tags, these IDs, these Elodio IDs, these uh, anything that a national needs in order to be complete. That's what's going on in the world today. Uh, if I don't have y'all's in the mail by Tuesday, and by Monday of next week, y'all ain't got y'all documentation, y'all could be screaming at me. Y'all know my number. I got, I done gave, I, I'm transparent in every way, shape, or form. Y'all know every way to reach me, where I live, and everything. It does not matter. Abernathy. Tons lost world filler. Man, look. <laughs> um, I'm going to be back with y'all as soon as I get organized. At the beginning of this email, everybody that just jumped on here is where you can send your nationality request and instructions how. I love y'all all. I'll be back soon. Woo!